you're back here with ridebits.com and I'm going to show you how to set up distance based rates starting from the dashboard I'm going to go down and click on rate setup once I reach my rate setup screen I'm going to go over to distance based rates and choose sedan for my example if you look here you will see that you can set the base transfer distance by clicking on the edit link. Currently I have it set to 50 miles. Next if you notice I have the first distance estimate set to 50 miles. The base charge is $50. The cost per distance unit is $3 and the miles per distance unit is one mile. I can change this if I want by clicking on the edit button. Let's go ahead and let's click edit. I currently have one rate group set up and it's named regular. As you can see it's set to 50 miles, base charge is $50, cost per distance unit is $3, and the distance per unit is one mile. Now if I had made changes to this I would just go ahead and click on update distance estimate. Now let's go ahead and add a new distance estimate setting by clicking on the button. Once again I only have one rate group set up and it is named regular. This time I'm going to set the miles to 100 miles. There we go. This time I'm going to change the base charge to $40. There's 40. Cost per unit is now going to be set to $2. Miles per distance unit is going to be $1. I'm going to go ahead and click on Add Distance Estimate. There we are. Now what this is saying is up to 50 miles the base charge is going to be $50 and the cost per distance unit is $3 and that's one mile per distant unit. Now anything between 50 and 100 miles is going to be charged at a base charge of $40 cost per distance unit of $2 once again it's one mile per distance unit. If you have any other further questions regarding rate setup or anything else, please feel free to contact us at support at ridebits.com.